Hi everyone, I'm Dee Dee Rince-Hughes, in for Shania Chavis Rucker, happening in Fulton. Each May, the nation focuses on the issue of mental health as a part of Mental Health Awareness Month. And after a year of being in a pandemic where isolation and depression have both become common, this year the county is putting even more emphasis on the awareness campaign. Latrina Foster is the director of the county's Department of Behavioral Health and Developmental Disabilities. Thank you for having me today. Latrina, since May is Mental Health Awareness Month, tell us why this is so important. So May is Mental Health Awareness Month, and it's always been very important to us, especially those of us that work in the world of mental health, behavioral health, to ensure that we increase awareness around um, the relevance of mental health and people living with mental health disorders within our communities. I think in 2021, it's even more relevant that we acknowledge and talk about mental health. I think throughout 2020, we heard a lot of um, politicians talking about the importance of mental health because of COVID. So many people experience high levels of depression and anxiety. So out of all years, I would say that May 2021 is very important to ensure that we are aware that mental health disorders are real, um, that it's relevant, and that we should all just press pause and pay attention to our own mental health to ensure that we're okay. How prevalent is mental illness amongst the U.S. population? Yeah, so in the United States, um, one out of every five American um, as an adult will experience a mental health disorder at some point in their life. Um, so with that said, that's, that's a very high level, well, a very high number of individuals that will experience a mental health disorder at some point in their life. But the importance for all of us to acknowledge and to be aware of is that just because you have a mental health disorder does not mean that you do, you're not able to function. You're able to function, recovery is possible. It's important that you engage in treatment and that you adhere to those effective strategies that work in your life so that you can live an independent and productive life. What is your department doing to spread awareness of behavioral health issues? So the Fulton County Department of Behavioral Health and Developmental Disabilities is rolling out what we, what we call Mental Health Mondays. And so we're offering, offering a series of videos every Monday, very short videos that provide you with effective coping strategies on various topics. So every Monday, tune in. You can always go back and catch the video if you miss it, but they're very short, but they just give you some quick tips on ensuring that you are okay mentally. The Fulton County Board of Commission are so supportive of our department in ensuring that people have access to behavioral health services. On May 5th, proclaimed May as Mental Health Awareness Month. So we definitely have the support of our elected officials to ensure that the community is aware of mental health resources throughout our community and that we're all taking a moment to increase our knowledge around mental illness. Latrina, wrap it up for us. But I just encourage every single one of us to take time and take care of yourself. Whatever that is for you, whatever type of relaxation skills work for you, if that's listening to music, getting out, taking a walk, if it's exercising, if it's just calling your grandmother, your mom, whomever it is, just to talk on the phone and make sure that they're okay. And sometimes just doing a kind gesture for other people takes the attention off of you. And it makes you feel good about yourself because you were able to bring some level of satisfaction or pleasure to another person. So my advice to all of us is to take care of ourselves and recognize that it's okay not to be okay, but there are ways in order for you to walk a path of being okay. That's just some of what's happening in Fulton. To stay connected, be sure to follow on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can check us out on our YouTube channel, so please do us a favor and subscribe. That does it for this edition. Thank you so much for watching. Join us daily for news around and about Fulton County.